Hi guys, I have yet another yarn haul for you today. Um, <clears throat> I feel like I just keep um, hauling yarn and I swear I'm actually making stuff with this yarn. <laughs> I feel like as a beginner crocheter, it's so easy to want to try every new yarn. There's so many beautiful textures and colorways and you just, every time you see something pretty, you want to get it. You know what I mean? So I'm trying to rein that in because obviously, I mean, well, I shouldn't say obviously, but I'm not a super wealthy person. I don't have the money to buy every yarn that I think is pretty. Um, So I need to chill out on the purchasing and, and get to making all the projects that I want to make. But um, anyway, I have this yarn haul. I am going to have to make a premiere order again because I didn't have enough um, in my last order for one of the projects that I'm doing so I am going to have to order some more um and uh those if you did watch that premiere video um the three dollar not the three dollar the six dollar three packs the th uh, three skein packs of the Eversoft yarn for six dollars that sale is still going on so if you were wanting to take advantage of that I would say do it soon because I don't know how much longer that's going to last. So, and I should be able to get this uploaded today. If you're watching this on February 29th, you get free shipping on the Premier website for orders over $29 today only. So, anyways, back to this yarn haul. So, this yarn haul is an order from Webs, which is online. I, I think the website is just called yarn.com. Um, I was watching, um, a Mosaic Crocheters video and she held up this yarn and her style is totally different from mine. Like she's, she's got a very like gothic vibe to her work. Um, but I still really like what she does. I wouldn't use the same colors, but I like, I like her work, you know? And, um, she held up this yarn called Taki Tandem and I immediately fell in love with it. It's got a nice kind of mixture of textures within the yarn and um I fell in love with it right away looked it up there's a particular colorway called wildflower I was immediately like oh my god I need to have that yarn <laughs> so um I I held off on buying it for a while but um last week I looked and webs actually had that particular yarn on sale so I went ahead and I bought it and um, I picked up a couple of other things too, naturally, because, you know, why not? So now getting into the yarn. Um, let me pull it out here. I'll just go with what's on top first. So this one that I have first here is from Sirdar. Sirdar, hopefully I'm pronouncing that correctly, um, but it's their jewel spun Aaron weight yarn and it's just a really it's got a very nice feel to it nice and soft um, just a really pretty combination of colors there this one is in the colorway where are you at golden feldspar so you can see some like dusty roses, some kind of smoky grays, some green, some turquoise, a little like mustardy yellow in there. Um, just really, really pretty. These ones are, um, it's a 200 gram skein, so you get 546 yards, 100% um, acrylic. Um, I think it says to use a five millimeter hook on it. I swear my eyesight is getting worse. Um, and I just got these glasses. Like I just started wearing them a few months ago. Um, yeah. So anyways, that is the golden feldspar in the jewel spun collection from Sirdar. So I got a couple skeins of that. And then next, 
I have oh, the Creative Lazy Hazy Summer Cotton Decay. And this is in the shade, I want to say it's E-Crew. And I feel like the color name is on the inside here where I can't see it. Is it on? Yes, the colorway is called E-Crew. So there's a close-up of that. Nice, pretty combination of grays, pinks, yellows little orange so this is a like I said it's a 50 gram skein or I think I said that um, we've got 49% cotton 46% acrylic and 5% polyester um, it says it's a size 4 yarn which I don't know. Is it that is that a size four? I don't know. That might be more like a three. But very pretty. I love that combination of colors. And uh made in Belgium. Where was this one made at? Does it say? I've noticed lately a lot of the yarns that I pick seem like they're made in Turkey. I guess um, maybe Turkey is like a big, like yarn is a big export from there. I'm not sure. I don't know where this one's made from. But anyways, so that's that. And I think I got um, six of these. So Lazy Hazy Summer Cotton. And then finally, last but not least, is the Taki Tandem. And it is so pretty. So, 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 so pretty. So that is the Taki Tandem. And I just fell in love with those bright colors mixed with the kind of more muted like greens and blues and grays in there. It's so pretty. So this yarn is, uh, let's see. Where's it at? Oh, right here. 28% cotton, 28% viscose, 28% nylon, and 16% acrylic. Made in Italy. Um, yardage, you get a hundred, a hundred and seven yards per skein. And it says, I believe it says a five millimeter crochet hook is what you would want to use with that. Yeah, it does. It says a five millimeter. But I just, I love that kind of You've got the muted tones, you've got the bright tones, there's a little bit of metallic threading in there. I just love the combination of textures all on that one yarn. Very, very pretty. And I just happened to be watching a bit, they just dropped this off at the door and I was watching a crochet video um, for a leaf patterned, um, like a sweater. A lightweight like kind of like an open an open stitch kind of pattern to it which would be a really good like for spring summer type of thing that you can just throw on over top of a tank or a tee or whatever um and that's what I was wanting to do with this is find some sort of lightweight kind of either sweater or a shawl or a cowl or something that I can throw on over top of a tank for the summertime or for the spring and the summer um, to use this with. So I might, I might do that pattern because it's really, really cute. I don't know. Um, if I remember, I'll link the video that I was watching down below if you want to check it out. So, oh, I love that so much. 
so pretty and they have quite a few different colorways of this I want to say there was at least like maybe like 12 or 14 different colors and they were all really pretty so there's definitely something for everyone and they're actually all three of these yarns had some really pretty colorway choices so I definitely would recommend checking out any of them but yeah so I picked up six skeins of that one too and that is it that is my haul for today and now I've just got to get to making stuff so I hope everyone's having a great day and I will talk to you guys later.